welcome to Academic Game Tutorials. In today's class we are going to study, sand blow, pinholes, sand wash, scabs, penetration, mold shift, core shift, mold crack, which are factors taken into consideration in the inspection of casting quality, and casting quality inspection methods. We are studying fundamentals of metal casting, and metals for casting. We will cover all related topics one by one. Before starting, if you haven't subscribed to this channel yet, just click on subscribe, and press the bell icon. Here, we come up with new videos on different subjects, to make the academic studies easier for you. So, into the topic. Sand blow, is a defect consisting of a balloon-shaped gas cavity caused by release of mold gases during pouring. It occurs at or below the casting surface near the top of the casting. Low permeability poor venting, and high moisture content of the sand mold are the usual causes. Pinholes, which are also caused by release of gases during pouring, consist of many small gas cavities formed at or slightly below the surface of the casting. Sand wash, are an irregularity in the surface of the casting that results from erosion of the sand mold during pouring, and the contour of the erosion is formed in the surface of the final cast part. Scabs are rough areas on the surface of the casting due to encrustations of sand and metal. It is caused by portions of the mold surface flaking off during solidification and becoming embedded in the casting surface. Penetration refers to a surface defect that occurs when the fluidity of the liquid metal is high, and it penetrates into the sand mold or sand core. Upon freezing, the casting surface consists of a mixture of sand grains and metal. Harder packing of the sand mold helps to alleviate this condition. Mold shift, refers to a defect caused by a sidewise displacement of the mold core relative to the drag. Core shift, similar to mold shift, but it is the core that is displaced, and the displacement is usually vertical. Core shift and mold shift are caused by buoyancy of the molten metal. Mold crack, occurs when mold strength is insufficient, and a crack develops into which liquid metal can seep to form a fin on the final casting. Casting quality inspection methods include Visual inspection to detect defects such as misruns, cold shuts and severe surface flows. Dimensional measurements to ensure that tolerances have been met. And, metallurgical, chemical, physical and other tests concerned with the inherent quality of the cast material. So, we have studied sand blow, pinholes, sand wash, scabs, penetration, mold shift, core shift, mold crack, which are factors taken into consideration in the inspection of casting quality, and casting quality inspection methods. Thank you.